Hello and welcome to the show. We are here today on GTA 5 for another Survive the Hunt. We are going to be continuing with the Taskmaster style of these, where I'm going to have to try and complete 12 tasks. We're going for a slight change in the number. Uh, we're, going to, we're going to see if I can possibly survive all of these, all of these tasks. Uh, this lot <laughs> are going to be trying to... Oh, you've not got the Mexican wave going on properly. Oh, there we go. It, it, it's improved now. It has improved. There we go. Uh, it's close. It was, it was close. Can you go back the other way now? Oh, no, no, you started the wrong side. No, it's all gone wrong. Uh, <laughs> it's the least coordinated. <laughs> Can I do this? With, does my vehicle actually, does it work on this? I've got completely distracted. Uh, can we do hood? Yes, we can! Uh, <laughs> we're just now doing signals to each other. I feel like we've got completely away from the point. Shall we get going? Yeah. We're off. Um, the way this game mode works, if you haven't seen this before, I've got to try and survive whoa, while completing the various tasks. Um, and I've got to complete 12 of them, and then I win. While trying to complete said tasks that can be all sorts of different things, that lot of hunters are going to be trying to track me down. Now, there is no map, there is no name over players, so my best chance of survival is going to be stealth. I'm not going to be driving a flying car or hovering car. I'm not allowed to use this. It's fun. I, I thought I'd grab something different for the little intro starty drive bit, uh, but I'm not going to be using the flying car. Um, once, once we get going, we're going to be trying to blend in with the old traffic. That did not want to go up. Uh, we I don't know what we're going to be driving at the moment. Gauntlets look a good possibility. Uh, whoop, and over we go. Yeah, we try and blend in with traffic. The best chance of survival is going to come from uh, blending in while trying to complete these, these these tasks. They can be all sorts of things. They can be drive to various locations. They can be uh, deliver a specific car to a specific location. I got away with that one last time. Uh, they could be kill a hunter. Uh, there's, there's all sorts of different stuff. I don't know. I don't know what we might we might see some repeats of stuff we've seen before. Things like keeping lights on or lights off, depending on what time of day it is. Uh, changing the color of your car, modifying stuff. There's a huge number of tasks that we're going to get sent via the in-game phone. Whoops, I'm not having much... I probably shouldn't have had this in hover mode. It drives really funky in hover mode. It's, it's kind of fun to drive in an uncontrollable way uh, in hover mode. Uh, I really think like a gauntlet has got... Gauntlet's really got to be the way to go. There's no point in agonizing too much over the starting car because, well, we're often swapping vehicles. Who knows what I'm going to end up having to do with the tasks. I don't tend to stay in a car particularly long. Uh, what sort of gauntlet? A nice grey gauntlet? A grey gauntlet with no stripe on it. Seems like a good idea. You know what? You can have a flying car, my friend. Uh, I feel like I have been uh, a bit short-changed in this. Although I can actually just get rid of my car. So we are going to do that uh, as whoop, we can go in here and return that to storage. Uh, so they won't know where it is. They won't... I don't care if they blow it up. Uh, if they find out... It doesn't really matter. If they do find the car... They might have a rough idea of what I'm... They're going to have a rough idea of what I'm going to be driving anyway. They know what I'm likely to be doing. Um, right, let's go... Not Sneaky Blakey. Uh, I don't even... That's always a, That might be a little too expensive. This should work. Uh, we will jump into this. Oh, back into the car and we are good to go. Uh, I will have to sort out outfits for next time I think I'll have to get some get some new ones on the go because uh, I've, I've ran I mean you kind of run similar ones as long as you're kind of nondescript the chances of them remembering what I wore last time are very slim the blue shirt is just a little bit too brighter a blue uh, it, it's not that it's not what the AIs wear I'm sure they, they, they will wear kind of similarly brightly colored stuff but it's more the fact that it slightly stands out when they're like driving along. They look into windows. Across. Now that could be helpful to me at some point. Like if I wear it, get spotted, and then change it. If I remember to change it, possibly. Um, now I did. I will say this much. I will say this much. I have bought a proper motorcycle helmet. So if we spot a bike, I could potentially go for using it. There are dangers associated with bikes. They're very quick. They're very, very quick. They're very difficult to catch. As long as it's a good bike. Some bikes are terrible. But, uh, yeah, in general terms, the bikes are very fast. But there is the big risk that if things go wrong, you can fall off them. I can't fall off a car. Uh, but I can get wiped off of a bike. And... 
It's, it's a risk versus reward thing. It might be a play that we go for. It might be something that I contemplate. We will have to wait and see. There are quite a lot of high-end cars are spawning here. Which is good, potentially. Um, now, the, re I say this, the main reason... Uh, number one, lose tyre for next task. What? Not quite sure what, how that one there works. Does that mean I don't do anything now and have to shoot out the tyre for the next one? I am confused. Also, was that Comet just pushing the thing along? Oh, lose tire until next task is complete. That's what it means. Okay, sorry, I've just figured it out. Uh, so I guess we've got to go up here, and then we can do it. What gun has a silencer on it? Uh, I think this one. I didn't really need to buy more silencers. Uh, no, don't shoot out a rear tire. Shoot out a front tire. Um, I think I'd rather have the traction. Although I will now lose steering. But so that's the sort of thing that. Uh, that can go on. So yeah, we'll take out the tyre. Uh, now, what I might be able to get away with here is not have it burst. This is difficult. Basically, if I drive slow enough, and if I'm stop, start, stop, start, I will hopefully be driving slow enough. I don't know what happens if I have to change car with this task, but who knows? We'll see what the next task is. Hopefully, if I can just sit at lights and... Jeez! Okay, that's one of them. That makes more sense. <laughs> I was about to say, do a J turn. Oh no. Uh, I'm going to guess this is like an immediate one. Okay, the tyre's gone. Uh... Oh no. Oh no, I've got to abandon this car really quickly. If they see that tyre, I'm screwed. I've completed it, I can get rid of this car, but what do I do with it? There are people everywhere already. This is bad news for me. Uh... Uh, okay, plan. I don't know whether an AI would ever drive in here, but my plan is just to ditch the car. There's too many people around for this to be anything other than suspicious. So there are two SUVs, all-wheel drive. Um, I feel like the J-Tone was supposed to be one I had to do immediately, and it didn't... No, they're supposed... The text message is supposed to say... They're supposed to come up with, like, immediate... If it's a thing I have to do. Um, immediately. I don't know whether that was just forgotten in the message. It felt like it was supposed to be done immediately, so I did it anyway. Thankfully, it did kind of work. Uh, I'm actually happy over here. This bit's in the nice middle of bloody nowhere. I'm hoping there is a car park I can get something from. Uh... I will see. Um, uh, Danger Man. Has, so, so Danger Man is running the tasks again. Uh, I think managed to miss seeing me do the J turn, but uh, <laughs> we're we're just getting a little bit of confirmation going on. It's the, the Taskmaster thing is it's very fun. It just takes a quite a lot of communication. Um, that is not always the easiest thing in the world to do. Uh, we are kind of stuck on foot a little bit at the moment. What am I going to do? I need a car. I need a car, and I want a good car. Um, a Comet. So the, the other thing I was going to say before we got distracted by tasks is if I have something like a Comet and I have to modify a car, I can't modify the sports cars. You, you can't customise them. So I'm kind of tempted to wait and see what the next task is and then figure out what to do car-wise. We've actually burnt through these first ones really quickly, uh, which is helpful. I might grab if something... If something stops up here at the right time, I'd be tempted to grab it. Uh, no, god damn it. Nothing spawning. Come on, game. Spawn a car for me up this. No, you're not going to spawn a bloody car for me. I don't really want to cross the road because if there is a hunter around, and they have seemed to be quite close, I might be able to grab. And there's still some car parks here. Ah, oh, no, it's parked out there. Now, the AI will, as you can see ahead, they are crossing over those, these areas. Um. So that is perfectly natural. I'm walking a little bit quickly. If we get to this set of lights and the cars are stopped, I can maybe... Ugh, there's a car park on the other side of a bloody road. Uh, recite favourite Chris quote whilst exploding car. Oh, uh, right. Okay. Oh, God. The favourite uh, favorite Chris quote is difficult. Um, God, I, I do not know what my favourite Chris quote is. However, we are going to need a new car. 
um, whatever we do, I feel like I might go for a little bit of speed here. Uh, right. We're going to borrow this car. It's probably not going to last. I've never ever driven a Serrano in one of these before. Ooh, hello. Um, I'm quite wanted now. I'm going to guess this is a uh, Simeon car. Right. Lester. Buddy, could hey you... Um, what can I help you with? We shall remove okay, wanted okay, level. Okay, dokie. Okay. No Sticky problem. bomb time. Uh, oh, I should have done. I should have blown the car up. Never mind. I guess we can call Lester and do cops turn a blind eye as well. Uh, right. Let's go and I take it this is uh, do call. this. Cops turn a blind eye. Okay, okay gives me a couple of minutes. I'm still trying to think what my favourite Chris quote is. There is so so many of them. Uh, right. Let's go and. Sticky bomb. Oh, uh, wait, hold on. I've got to find a parked car. If I sticky bomb a moving car, it's going to freak out and run away. Actually, it doesn't really matter to me. Uh, yoink. Okay. It's not actually. doesn't care about the sticky bomb in the back of the car. Uh, I can't. There's so many quotes. I, I don't know what would be my favourite. We'll go with the, the one. Uh, <laughs> one of the more recent ones um, that uh, Lado said during the Survive the Hunt live stream, uh, which was basically if you, if you watch Jaws backwards, it's basically a shark. Um, giving limbs to disabled people. Yes! <laughs> Thank you, Lado. Thank you for being in the best place possible. <laughs> now, that was a gift. If ever there was a gift, uh, th that was it. Oh, I've crashed into it. I've got to get rid of this car. It's scratched and it's burnt, but that was just... It was so worth it. That was... That was a million times worth it. Uh, where can I even abandon this car? I'm not playing this game seriously. I've just realised I am not taking this seriously in the slightest. Um, we should probably take it slightly more seriously. Uh, things have gone a little bit, lot bit silly. Uh, <laughs> I need a new car. Mine's all scratched up. Please don't notice it. Thank you. Um, oh, there's a lot of cars around here. There's there's a lot of cars around here. Um, they may notice the scratches on this. I'm hoping this traffic... Oh, uh, this traffic's a bit of a problem, really. Uh, I'm not sure. They might notice the... They might notice the lack of indicators on me. Uh, possibly. I thought that Super Diamond actually was one of them. It might not be. I really want to get rid of this car now. It's too scratched up. It's too... It's too distinctive, this vehicle. I think they were looking at the gauntlet because it was parked a mile over the traffic light. Maybe me crashing into that gauntlet actually helped me because it pushed the gauntlet forward. Um, yeah. <laughs> Danger Man appreciated the uh, thing. I'm not so the car delivery. Okay, I'm going to get a. So that was the the text. Uh, sorry, the, the the thing that we've just got sent uh, by the game phone is the. Um, challenge. I'm now being sent on Discord, I think, the locations of where I'm supposed to be picking a car up and where I'm delivering it off to. Uh, we need a new vehicle. I need to ditch the Serrano. It's too... It, as I say, the, the, the damage does not always sink, so the damage on my end, you know, is extensive scratches and probably a headlight out. On their end, it might not show anything. It might show a lot worse. It's difficult to know. Right, so what have we got to do? Just a classic from the big amphitheatre to the Maze Bank Arena. Hmm, okay. The amp so the amphitheater is... Ooh, this is a nasty challenge. Uh, the car is very quick. What can I do? Oh, I just kind of run a stop. Uh, no one else stops either, so it doesn't really matter. Um, the, the amphitheater... I should have gone left there, but that was the way the SUV ended up. Hmm... I'm just pondering. Currently, see, last time around I managed to sneak a car without really being visible to anybody. This time around is going to be a little bit more difficult. Uh, how can I do this? I can sneak a fair bit of the way. I say sneak. So, the big amphitheater, we can jump across and go via the horse racing circuit. We can then loop around behind that. Um, uh, so we can go. We can 
we'll have to blast down that road, jump across the motorway. We can jump to the horse race, we can kind of drive around the mountains a bit. We might be able to sneak our way... Ah, the problem is that it kind of doesn't really take us where I need to go. Like, we could sneak along that way, we could get to the airport, we could get to the docks, but that's not really close to the arena. We're going to have to bomb it. The thing that we're not really... There's just uh, the scene... I presume Longbow went past in the green car, I could be wrong, and then there's a Daytona over there with the uh, Red Land Rover. Oh, I'm in the wrong bloody lane, but I can't. I've got to commit to going this way now, which I don't really want to. Um, well, the Daytona's had a crash. Uh, I don't quite know what's going on here. Um, <laughs> by the looks of it, the Land Rover picked up a, a uh, Lado, uh, who is out, but I guess can be a kind of spectator if you... Uh, regardless, how am I going to do this? I can bomb it across a little bit. I just don't know how I'm going to get down. How on earth am I going to get... How I can't sneak it, really. Bloody hell, the lights had literally not gone green yet, and the bullet was already overtaken. I just didn't want to stop for the lights at all. I just thought it'd overtake me. If we head along this road, I think it'll take me out to where I want to go, roughly. Uh, we could go back up to the top of the hills, but Jesus Christ, AI. They are really not in the mood today, are they? Just want to be assholes. I'm not appreciating it. Maybe this is the karma for blowing up Lado. Uh, the AI, uh, the AI, doomed to be unbelievably impatient now. Uh, that is a pretty heavily damaged. What's it called? Stania. I want to call it a Grand Marshal. It's not. That's the uh, Beam NG Drive version of it. Uh, I, I will inevitably call it a Grand Marshal. I have a really bad habit of calling it that. Uh, is that a Yuan truck? It is a Yuan truck. <laughs> the big gold truck is uh, driving around. So I, think, I mean, they're going to be on the lookout for a Jester Classic. The, the problem is, is, if I get spotted, I don't know how on earth I'm going to... I mean, if I get spotted, the, I guess the only way to really do it, complete the task, is I have to lose them first. I have a high-performance car, so I would have the speed to lose them, possibly. I don't know what aircraft. I've got a blimp somewhere. I don't know what aircraft, if they've, what, what they've got up. I haven't actually seen anything. I didn't even think about it. Uh, this has been a very distracted Survive the Hunt. That... Uh, Hmm. What is going on with the AI? They seem to be extra derpy today. I mean, not that they're not normally derpy, they are normally very derpy, but they seem to be extra specially derpy today. Uh, okay, so... Me in pondering car delivery routes. I think my best bet, if I'm gonna do this, it might be the big bridge. That might be the way to do it, weirdly. If I go across that bridge, that covers a lot of ground. I mean, it covers a lot of ground, it's not perfect, and if I go on the bridge, I am stuck. Uh, if they if they see me go onto the bridge, sorry, I am kind of screwed, because they can blockade it and everything. Uh, there is one point I can turn off if I reckon I'm being chased, and I probably would bail off of the, that, that bridge. Because, uh, yeah, basically, we're going to kind of follow... We're going to jump down by the casino, we'd follow that road, blast off towards the docks area. Not quite to the docks area, kind of the Mirror Park area. That's, that, that kind of feels like the best chance I got. If I can do it quick, there's not really any... No, there is a stealth option. There is a stealth option. I can go quite a long way in, a, in the drain bit, can't I? Oh, uh, well, it's kind of a stealth option. Um, I can get some distance. But, oh, god damn it, AI. I'm just going to have to go there. I hope no one was looking. I can go down the storm. I can go down the drain bit that, like, that runs behind. But that doesn't really ever get me across. That just gets me down to the bottom of the map. Which, what use does that have? Because I'll jump back up. No, I'm still maybe better off on the bridge, I think. I'm, I'm trying to think of a clever strategy. I'm trying my best to think of a clever strategy, and that one is... Uh, there's not one... There's not one forthcoming at the moment. 
Yeah. The main up because the problem is the boy is going on. It, literally every single car wants to overtake me. Now the standing air in front isn't bloody moving. It's a green light, and I can't sit there like that. Uh, I guess we can take a left here. I'm not likely to be overtaken if I go like this lane is not likely to have a car try and overtake me. So we'll park down here. Uh, yeah, I think the I f I'm still leaning towards the whole let's boot it across the bridge and just pray I'm lucky at that point. Pray that there no one is parked because would they look at the bridge if I was uh, they do sometimes circulate around that part it's less likely they're going to be looking at that bit Okay, to me to me the kind of back route around Mirror Park and around by the uh, that area is the less least likely to run into a hunter. If I didn't go quick enough, I say if I can go quick enough, but if we boot it. Yeah, I mean, there's, there's dangers attached to it, but it, it'll cover the most ground in the least conspicuous way for, for want of a better route. I guess you could bomb it down the motorway, but you go through the centre of the city, and the chances of you getting... Mm, it's kind of tempting though, because I, I would be right on the motorway. I could just drop down onto there and boot it. And that road basically leads you to the stadium. <laughs> but it relies on there being no one there looking. Whoops. Uh, which is a big... That's a big reliance. The chances of you running into somebody along that road is pretty high. Whereas at least around the back of Mirror Park, it's... Yeah, I, I'm really umming and ahhing on this one. Do you just go for it as the crow flies, but run a big risk, or do you try and be a bit sneaky? I'm sure there is a sneaky way I could do this, I just haven't thought of it. I mean, unless I go find a cargo bob and carry it, but that would be quite obvious as well, let's face it. Uh, now, where is... I mean, I'm not going to get really spotted up here. This is really edge of my area. Don't really come out this way very much. Um, this is where I've gone all the way now. There. I mean, you can't get much bloody hell. You can't get much more obvious than that. It's a nice car. It will be quick. Yeah. <laughs> Funnily enough, I'm not going to stealth it with an orange and blue car. There's no stealth involved here. Right. No mistakes. No crashes. We're just going to boot it, I think. Uh, where is it? We're going to have to just boot it. We're going to go bridge. Could we get dumped out by the airport? And it's not very far to the stadium from there, I don't think. Let's give it a try. Let's see if this plan will work. I don't know, uh, but I'm going to give it. I'm going to give it the best shot. Uh, I'm not going to mess around. I'm not going to bother messing around with like the track, with the mountains. I don't see the point. It's not going to get me very far undercover, going that way. So we're just going to boot it. Change of plan. I don't know whether that car saw me. Uh, okay, new plan has been jump on the motorway. Did that green car see me? Well, I'm glad I had a backup plan because how did if that didn't see me? I have no idea how it didn't see me. Uh, we are going for blast through the city now. Um, yeah, that's unbelievable. If that hasn't seen me, and I legit don't think it has because it's not even turned to follow me. Uh, we're just going blinding speed, blinding speed. I think this road leads us all the way straight through to the stadium. Uh, pretty much, yeah, because there it is. Just foot down, go, 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 Jester. Please don't let them spot me now. Uh, we've done a really, really good job. Uh, oh, oh. I don't think... I don't think there has been anybody... Uh, Limps the wrong side of all of this, and even better. Uh, where is it? No, wrong way. There we go. <laughs> I'm 
not going to get to keep this bike because we're going to have to do something silly, I have no doubt. But we have a motorbike. I haven't seen any bike sporting in traffic, so this might be a bad idea, but I do have a motorbike. I'm going to see what the next challenge is. I feel like a bike is a bad call at this stage, but we're going to be brave. I should never, ever have survived that. 100% shouldn't have managed to do what I just did. How that car... It, the, the camera must have just been looking the wrong way. And they somehow didn't notice. Or they just assumed it was a... No, but another hunter wouldn't drive. Like, the jester's too quick for the hunters. Uh, there are some sort of rough rules for what the hunters can drive in terms of vehicles. They're allowed sort of personal vehicles as long as they're... Ride a roller coaster. Eh, okay, we can do that. That's not too much of a problem. Yeah, there are some rules for the for the hunters in, in terms of their vehicles. They're allowed personal cars, but they're not allowed to be sort of performance modified, and they've got to be fairly basic. You can have, so you can have like the, the trucks and all that. Um, but just a classic would be far too fast to be allowed. So I don't, unless they just didn't think they didn't put two and two together. Uh, that is possible. That is that is possible. But I don't know. The, the lack of other bikes is a concern for me. I want to see a few other bikes. I mean, we found this legit. It was spawning. The fact that no one else has got one is a concern. And I don't know what the traffic is going to do. I guess this is going to be a little bit of a test. What is going on over there? It's a Daytona's had a crash. <laughs> oh, dear. Well... Daytona has driven past. I mean, we do know that if I get into a chase, the bike is, is so quick that it would be difficult to deal with. This is a decent enough bike. It's not the fastest, but it's good enough that they would have a bad time trying to catch me. Uh, whether we're still going to have the bike by the end of the roller coaster ride, I don't know. I feel like the roller coaster is a little bit of a dangerous one for me here. Um, I don't think it notifies them. If, you, if a person's going on it. It might, though, if you are close. I don't know how it's going to work, but we're going to try and... We're going to go on the roller coaster and try not to get killed in doing it. Oh, bloody junction. Why? <laughs> it's such a mess. Traffic. Okay, other bikes are dry. Other bikes are spawning. Good news. Very good news indeed. I'm happy. Stuff is spawning. Cars are crashing. I swear no one is listening to any sort of rules. The AI traffic seems to be better when I'm on a bike. It legit does seem to be better behaved behind a bike than it does a car. None of this makes any sense. None of the, There is none of the logic. There is none of the logic at all. Uh, but now, actually, quite a few bikes are spawning. Oh, this is glorious. This is absolutely what we want. I mean, okay, the bike might not, might not last. There's loads of bikes everywhere. <laughs> I should probably put my lights on, because that one there had its lights on. We'll stick that on. Ah, oh, this is glorious. This is absolutely glorious. Well, I know someone who is not agreeing with this currently. There's going to be an annoyed Lado. There is absolutely going to be an annoyed Lado. What bike is that in front of us? That's a different bike to this one. Is it? Yeah, it is. It's got, they've got twin exhaust. I wonder if it's modified, but yeah, I wouldn't drive a modified bike, I don't think. Um... The reason I'm going down here, by the way, is I can go and park in the car park, uh, and this bit here is quieter, basically. It, it's all about a little bit of risk... I say risk avoidance. I've been so damn lucky. Um, we somehow... We blew up Lado and got away with it. And somehow I didn't get seen. I feel like we've used our nine lives... ...already, and we... How many, how many tasks am I in here? This is task five. God, we're almost halfway. We're almost halfway. I mean, we got through some of the early tasks very quickly. We were able to do them. Uh, yeah, some some tasks uh, just take longer than others. The, the way this the way this format works, I like it. Uh, you, sometimes you can rattle through tasks like one after the other and just get them all done, but not always. Uh, and yeah, that's just how it goes sometimes. Why? What is the point of this lane? Why on earth would you go up there and t What? <laughs> Why? <laughs> what? It doesn't make any sense. Who's designed this road? Why do you have this lane if you're turning right up there? Oh, I'm not even going to question it. There are a few iffy lanes in GTA 5. I probably shouldn't think and 
complain too much about the wacky world uh, and the road rules, etc. Uh, but come on, there we go. I think I just don't, they're either not paying attention or they're unbelievably eager to get past you. Uh, I mean, yeah, like I'm not that fussed about the hunters at this stage. I mean, the chances of them seeing me here are pretty slim. Uh, we're going to go down and go into the big car park. Uh, I actually left it a little... I, went, I turned a, a block, I guess, too early. It's fine, it doesn't matter. I definitely like this bike idea, though, because the AIs really do give you a lot of space. Well, a lot more reasonable uh, space than we've been seeing from when I've been in the car. So that is a big bonus. Right, so we're down here. Uh, we will head towards the big car park and hope, hope my bike doesn't despawn while I'm doing this. It would be nice to get it again. Although I now I'm not seeing very many bikes around. Mm, we might have to change out of it. Possibly. Ah, oh, there's a Fagio. Uh, there's still some about. Uh, the bagger is a bike you do not want. It is terrible. Uh, so, yeah, we will avoid that one if one turns up. But this thing yeah, is, is good enough for me. Uh, right, okay. We are at the car park that we are looking for. Uh, I know we've got to turn into the car park. Uh, there we go. Alright, we are here. So, the hunters are sometimes told what task I have, and sometimes uh, it is just like a... Um, so tasks like this, for, for, for example, they will not be told I have to ride the roller coaster because, well, you know, they could camp out. Uh, what they're told is, for example, um, I... Oh, God, so I'm just trying to get my helmet because I don't want to be walking around. How do I get rid of... I just want none. Uh... Uh, why is that? I don't know why that's not working. Well, okay, sure, that will do the job. We'll, <laughs> we'll change clothes anyway. Um, sorry, sure, I got distracted. I don't know why I wasn't having an option of taking that off. But, yes, uh, as far as these sort of objectives go, the hunters will be told I'm at a visit objective, so visit a location, but they don't know what location it is. They won't know that I'm being told to go to the pier. Now, they are going to be, like, it's just all the Daytona blast past. They'll probably search areas that they think might be a location. So, the pier makes sense as a location that uh, might I might visit. Uh, it's like a landmark, so they might check out uh, other landmarks um, along the way. It's a lot of freaked out AIs, but the Daytona has buggered off, so I'm going to quickly cross the road while that's looking the other way. Once I'm across the road, I should be safe. Uh, just got to kind of keep an eye out here. I'm not going to get spotted, I don't think. Uh, I'll, you know, I'm sure walk in just in case. Uh, I've got 20 seconds for the next roller coaster. I don't know. I don't think it'll tell people that I'm on it. Um, it shouldn't. As far as I'm aware, it doesn't. That's fine. I could be spotted if someone searches the car park, which is why I'm still walking. Uh, we could probably probably safe at this point, I'm going to say. Uh, right. Here we go. We're at the roller coaster. We'll catch the next one. It doesn't matter. There's no time limit for me here. So we can sit here. Like, here is pretty safe. The chances of anybody coming in here are very, very slim. There is the blimp. I do spy. Um, I do spy. Spy? I do spy. Uh, Blimpus over there, so that can do its thing. It'd be tempting to shoot it down, but what's the point? It'll it's it's so far away. It'll be difficult to. Uh, it'd be, uh, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't think the rocket would even lock on or hit. And if I do fire, I, mean, I could maybe lock on and panic the blimp, and then I think I don't. I'm over there. Just not fire the rocket because uh, the the rocket the rocket will leave a nice big trail as to where I am and. There'll be little gain, because I'm not going to hit it from that distance. The rocket would run out of uh, range or whatever. Okay, roller coaster. Here, oh, come on, come on. There we go. We're <laughs> we are going to get into the roller coaster. Would the blimp, the 
Ah, the blimp's never going to see a person on the roller coaster, is it? There's no, there's no chance you're going to see a person on a roller coaster car. It's night time as well, so <laughs> I should have this horrible fear. We're going to go around the roller coaster. We're going to get to the end. We're going to come off, and there's going to be like a, a gun line of people waiting. I'll be indestructible while I'm on the coaster, but uh, yeah, let's uh, let's 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 hope they don't figure out what I'm doing. Just trying to have a look around, see if I can... Did I see something driving down there by the beach? Uh, no, I don't think so. There's a car in the car park. Just having a, a quick nose around. It's the, I'm fighting the camera so much because it wants to, to mess about. Ah, uh, yeah, there's a car in the car park. I can't really see anything at the moment. I mean, it, it's weird to be having... You know, we're on, we're on a fairground ride. I should be busy worrying about getting shot to pieces, but we're <laughs> going to have a go look at roller coasters. I like roller coasters. I've had a massive fan of roller coasters, as you can probably guess. Uh, generally, I think generally I find, like, petrolized people that like cars and motorsport and so on, generally like roller coasters because you like the speed and all of that. Not everybody, um, but it generally goes together quite well. Um, Alright, come on, moron. Let's get off this. Let's get out of here. Um, I mean, it's a fairly tame roller coaster at the end of the day, this one. Uh, let's go see if our bike still exists. Uh, we are... Um, we are done. We have completed the next... Oh, god damn it. I, I, I jumped to get over the barrier, that rope at the end, and we ended up just climbing over the sign. Sure. Oh! Sweet, we got an action figure. Oh, we made a thousand. We made a thousand dollars, which doesn't even come close to the cost of getting rid of the cops. Um, right, quick, cross, 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 while there's nobody about, and then we can go back to walking. Please, bike, still be there. If not, I mean, there's going to be a good selection of, of vehicles down in the car park. The blimp is close. That I don't like. That I do not like. Um, it's kind of just searching down that area. I'm not sure why. Maybe they've seen something. Uh, it's happened many a time before when the hunters get distracted and they just end up chasing each other. Um, yeah, I'm, ready. I'm, right now, I'm gonna oh, not each other, but uh, like random AI. Sorry, well, I'm gonna sit here and hope that that's what's going on and that they haven't really spotted anything. I don't think my bike's still gonna be here, is it? I've been um, I've went quite a long way and it was well out of sight, so I would imagine the render distance is gonna knock it out. I can't guarantee it though, it's worth a look. Uh, come on, bike, still be there, still be there. Ah, oh, you bugger! Lost my bike. Last. That was good. It was good while it lasted, but it didn't last very long. Uh, right, vehicle options. I mean, I kind of want to see what my next task is going to be before I commit to a car, because if it was a modified car one, I don't want to go grab. Will it roll? Oh, you bugger. Uh, hmm, there's an idea in here. There's an idea here. So, will it roll? I have to roll a car. Simple enough. My idea is a cunning one. I don't really want that because that's the alarm's going to go off. Are any of these not going to have an alarm? Other than the ones driving. Excuse me. I don't really want to wreck a Feltzer, but I do want to get a car without an alarm. Excuse me. Uh, I have a plan. I'm in a dark-coloured car. What I could do... There's the big uh, sand shark thing on the beach. Can I see the blimp? If the blimp's not around, I might just roll this and then go to the car park the other end and get another car. Uh, right, okay, here we go. We can go on the beach. We're so far away. I mean, the blimp is going to struggle to see this anyway. It's got no lights on. So if you're not looking for it... Uh, where is the big sand sharky bit? Somewhere down here, isn't it? There it is! Uh, can I hit it from this angle and roll the car? Uh, I would say that is complete. It has, thank you, game, for letting me know that while in an upside down car. Uh, <laughs> that's really useful information. Uh, right, and then... Maybe not grab that one, because that's a long, a long old drive back onto a road. But then we can go to this car park, grab something. Maybe a gauntlet. What is that? That is not a gauntlet. It's kind of this or It's a comet or the Stanier. 
Ah, uh, screw it. I'm gonna go for the comet. I'm gonna go for the comet because I need the Oh, wait, what are you there? <gasps> are you a gauntlet? Oh, game. How how fortuitous. How fortuitous indeed. You are very kind. Okay. And that is Will It Roll completed. Car swapped. Incognito on the beach. Okay, let's go. Next next challenge. Let's see what we've got to do. And we've got a car that, if needed, is quick but can be modified. It's perfect, really. We are halfway done as well in terms of the challenges. Uh, we've blasted through the last couple, uh, which is good. Hopefully, we can get a few slightly easier ones. Um, yeah, that's that is six now completed. If we can get a couple of easier challenges, we can blast through them. Would be good. Uh, actually, I don't have to wait till these ones. Throw a grenade. Oh, like that. That sort of challenge is lovely and easy. Uh, right. I actually should have checked this a lot better. Uh, we're just going to do this. I just want to get like a challenge, like just a number down. Uh, the grenade will go off. and But then we can just go and immediately do a uh, Lester... Uh, and get rid of the police. No one's around to see me run a red light. Uh, like, that's a really, really hey, straightforward up? challenge. Uh, that wasn't an instant challenge, okay, but I figured I was in a quiet area, so LSPD. why not just to me. do that and, and cover it? Uh, oh, the gauntlet in front. Oh, because the gauntlet in front's freaked out by the explosion. However, one there's a, there's a few events can go on can cause random explosions in GTA Online. I okay. uh, can't remember what they all what they all are. Um, and if they, like if the hunters hear random explosions like that, a lot of the time they'll try and figure out. But they're, they're so common that weird stuff goes on like that that they're not often thought about. Uh, so just a random grenade explosion is nothing major. So I think we can get away with that one quite easily. I mean, the blimp didn't really know, didn't really do anything. I mean, the blimp wouldn't have noticed that. It's too far away and blimp's too high up to really notice that one. So I'm going to say... That's relatively okay for me. The gaunt the freaked out gauntlet's gone. There's a lot of bikes around here. So I guess we need to do something. Yeah, we'll we'll see. We'll see what we have as our next great challenge. Uh, <laughs> grenade one was easy. I mean that's what I wanted. Wear normal suit for task nine. Okay. Uh nighttime is good for this. I'm gonna have to find somewhere that I can change. I don't know how I'm gonna where I'm gonna find this. Um, oh, they're freaked out a bike. Yeah, I've got to find somewhere I can pull into because I can't change while I'm in a car, which is a shame. Um, I would like to be able to. I'm so glad the cars behind me weren't pratting around here. Um, I wonder if... Oh, am I going to be able to stop? There's car parks off to my right, but A, I saw three hunters go that way, and... B, I can stop in them, but getting out of them is difficult. Uh, there is also, of course, car parks down this way. I like car parks for stopping in because you are undercover the whole time, but there's, just, there's a risk of getting out of them that's the problem. Getting out of a car park, oh, kind of what? Oh, no, I know where we can go. Whoa, blimp! <laughs> oh, no, I've uh, You know what? Oh, God. They've seen something. They've they've a hundred percent seen something. There's a lot of people rushing in a direction that's not where I am. I don't know what they've seen, but they've absolutely seen something. I, you know what? I might go park up. If we can go straight on, yeah. They're all blasting off down towards the stadium. I wonder if they found the Jester Classic, perhaps. I don't know. This is weird. This is really weird. They're all going mad heading down that way. Something's happened. Something's definitely happened. I'll be curious when we go back to the discussion video, see what it is. Because, um, yeah, something 100% has happened and is causing grief. I wonder if that's Gliska trying to do the sneaky tactic of drive. So this tactic has been tried against me before. It's never worked yet. Um, but drive a green F620 if they're spawning, and you hope that because I like the green F620, it's got good uh, fail race history, that uh, I will try and steal it given half a chance. It has never worked to date, I've never driven one, uh, but it's often Gliska that goes for that strategy. Uh, they are all around at the moment. Okay, here we go. Oh, God damn it, the tie. The tie is the problem part, basically, of this. 
Uh, the tie's the bit that gives me away. I'm hoping that because it's at night time, it's going to be a lot more difficult to see uh, that my character is wearing a tie. Now, I know I can turn. I did spot there was a hunter car behind, which is why I was kind of keen to get going. If they saw me pull away from the... Um, uh, where I parked on the side of the road. That's why I took this turn. Don't know what this next task is going to hold for me. Hopefully it can be completed very quickly. Found a Daytona doing donuts. Uh, I don't know what way I want to go. I don't know if I want to go this way, although whatever they were searching, they were going to have figured out wasn't me. So maybe it is a good idea to go this way. Because they're going to... They went down towards the kind of stadium way, but they're going to be heading out of that way, in theory at least, so... I say in theory, I, I still don't know what went on there. It was it was quite funny to see the mass, everything bolting, especially the blimp. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen the blimp move so fast. It was incredible. Oh, what is this next task going to be? I'm, I'm really hoping for something quick. I'm really hoping that we can get something quick. There's that F620 bombing around. Because uh, if I can get a nice quick task, get it done, park up, change back out of the suit, that would be really helpful. And then we're nearly there. We've only got that many more tasks to go. If we can get this one. No, I message someone... Message someone current vehicle drive. What? Message someone current vehicle drive for one minute. Okay, so I've got to message somebody uh, what I'm driving. Okay, I can do that. Uh, and then we drive for a minute. I haven't actually got my phone set up ready for a uh, thing. Ready for a timer. Okay. We will park in there. We will turn our car off. We're going to get a timer because I do not want to drive this car for any longer than I absolutely have to. Because uh, the gauntlet will be burnt. So we will message someone. Uh, right, that will work. I've got to reach around to reach my keyboard to do this, so bear with a second. Right, so the message is done. I will start the timer. We will... Actually, I shouldn't... I think Amy is driving that Daytona, which wasn't that far away from me. So, that is a little bit of a risk. That is a little bit of a risk doing that one. Although, they, that, they were kind of close to me at one point, but it's been a long time since I have seen them. Well, it's, it was a long time, but I've covered a fair bit of distance, and they could have gone a long... They could have gone a, a long way in that time if they were at full chat, essentially. Uh, so that is the kind of hope. And I'm being really sneaky. I just say I'm being really sneaky. I mean... I'm going to the airport because when I'm around this area, at this moment in time, I can head towards the airport, I can head to the car parks here. Oh. That is the car. Oh, I'm going to get spotted because I'm in my suit. I duck. Okay, the time is up. How on earth am I alive here? I need them to go. I need them to get out of here. Because they're going to be checking every gauntlet. Can I make a break for it and jump off there? Will it kill me? Uh, they didn't spot me when they checked my car. I don't know. God damn it, it's just sat at the airport. I can just see the lights. If it goes, I can leave here. I mean, the good news is it's not going to be suspicious about me despawning. Do you reckon they'd notice me get out of the car? Like, if I see the lights turn around at any point, we're just bailing. The blimp's here as well. This is a problem now. What do I do? Blimps overhead is going to see the gauntlet's not despawned, but the car is going to say, in theory, oh no, there's more of them turning up. I don't know whether I should have ran. I should probably have ran at this point. Uh, this is a problem bit now for me. <laughs> uh, yeah, this is a problem bit. <sighs> what? I don't know. They obviously, either they had figured out it was me and were waiting for me to go, um, that's really tough. Yeah, I mean, I guess... 
I guess, in theory, I should have run sooner. I should have got out of the car when they were further away. Um, but that time, they were very, very efficient at uh, managing to surround me. And I hoped that the fact that I hadn't moved would be enough for them to not, uh, not think about it. Uh, we got close. Again, we got really close. Uh, I definitely should have, you know, gone for the move a little sooner. Um, I think it was the suit, essentially, that did me in there. That's, that was a tough combination of, of ones to follow, um, is having to, having to wear the suit. I think that would have been what would have seen me, what would have, what would have got me seen, perhaps, the most in that. Um, the animation of ducking down as a player is not quite the same as a death animation. Uh, but what can I help you, with? you okay, might not know. You okay, might get away get with that part. No I just problem. moved the ones at level. I got one star, one to level again. Yeah, you might get away with that part. I, I guess what I probably should have done is once they'd left the car, I should have got out and jumped off the bridge. Might have been the way to go. It, it would have been day. I, I, I could just run the gauntlets quick. Um, yeah, I think I let, again. I left it a little too long. I tried to, I tried to, tried to brave it out a little unnecessarily. Uh, however, up until then, it was going really, really well. I got, I got quite, I got very lucky in a number of places. I just that luck eventually did run out, uh, which is perhaps not a particular surprise. Uh, as I said, I used a lot of a lot of my nine lives early on, and uh, <laughs> there was not enough of them for later. But that was really good fun. God damn it, we got close. We got really close. Um, but there we go. That is going to be it for this. For this video, thank you all very much for watching, and until next time, a goodbye.